Have you noticed that your motivation is not what it used to be? Or have you noticed that when you do accomplish something, your friends are more excited for you than you are for yourself? Have you ever noticed that you crave chocolate and you feel better when you actually uh, consume it? Have you ever noticed that if you don't feel like going out, but you end up going out, you usually feel better? You know, these are signs of something known as low dopamine. And it's a very common issue, very common problem, especially amongst those people who have thyroid disease. Now, I'm gonna to explain to you five reasons why people with thyroid dysfunction also have an issue with a neurotransmitter called dopamine. And dopamine is what we lovingly call the motivation molecule. So to understand what dopamine does, uh, we have to understand a little bit about how the brain works. First of all, dopamine is what inspires us to take action and actually do something. And it's what makes us feel good after we've accomplished something. So when people break this you know, motivation and reward cycle, they have a hard time maintaining and retaining habits, learning new tasks, retaining focus on a particular object or a subject or a task at hand. And what we see is people starting and stopping things all the time or people never following through with what they need to get done. And so a lot of uh, you know unfinished business or unfinished projects uh, loom over their heads. Now, there's five reasons why people with low thyroid function also have low dopamine production. The first one is because they both lack an, an amino acid known as tyrosine. You need tyrosine to make your thyroid hormone. You also need tyrosine to make dopamine. Tyrosine comes from proteins and proteins are digested by adequate amounts of stomach acid. People with low thyroid function generally don't eat enough protein or they have a hard time digesting it. The second reason why thyroid uh, patients often end up with low dopamine is because you need iron to make both thyroid hormone and to make dopamine from tyrosine. So in order for you to actually manufacture thyroid hormone and in order for you to manufacture uh, dopamine, you need to have adequate amounts of iron. People are low in iron because they don't make enough stomach acid or because their diets aren't dense enough in iron or because they're consuming foods that are sprayed with certain chemicals that deplete iron from the plants themselves. So there's a variety of reasons why somebody would be deficient in iron. The next reason that people have low dopamine and thyroid dysfunction is because of chronic inflammation. Chronic inflammation depletes our dopamine levels and we know that chronic inflammation is one of the things that is the driver of thyroid disease, especially Hashimoto's thyroiditis. The fourth reason why people struggle with low thyroid function and low dopamine production and motivation is because they have low levels of vitamin B6. You need B6 to make thyroid hormone and you also need B6 to make dopamine. So there's another reason why your low thyroid function and low dopamine and motivation are very closely connected. And the fifth reason, amongst many others, but the fifth reason is because of chronic brain-based inflammation. One of the main functions of thyroid hormone is to help us reduce uh, inflammation of the brain. When we don't make enough thyroid hormone, we have this perpetual chronic low-grade inflammation of the brain which causes brain fog. Anytime we have chronic inflammation, especially of the brain, we're gonna deplete neurotransmitters like dopamine. So in order for us to stay healthy, vibrant, energetic, motivated, inspired, and feel rewarded, not only do we need healthy thyroid function, but we also need healthy production of a neurotransmitter known as dopamine. And there's five reasons why people may not have enough. Now, the good news is, is that there is an actual quick fix solution. In life, there's not many quick fixes, but it turns out there's a plant extract called Macuna purians. And what Macuna purians does is it mimics the precursor in the brain of dopamine, which means that if you were to take it, you could bypass all of these steps of having adequate amounts of tyrosine, adequate amounts of iron, um, you know, adequate amounts of B vitamins and stressors, and you could convert this macuna into dopamine. Now this product is paired with B6, which enables you to enhance the metabolism of it. And what you'll notice in a very short period of time of taking it is you will have increased productivity, increased follow through, increased task completion, and an increased sense of reward, which will reinforce the behaviors that you're trying to turn into rituals and habits. So there you have it. There's five very clear reasons why your thyroid and low dopamine situation exist. And there's one really, really simple, easy fix, 
What I would suggest is that you start off with Dopa Boost. You take one Dopa Boost in the morning and you take one Dopa Boost at lunch and see how you feel. Try that out for 15 days, 30 days, give it a shot and you should notice increased productivity and way better follow through. Hope this helps. I hope this gives you the edge that you need to finish off some of those unfinished projects. I hope this gives you the motivation and inspiration that you needed to take action and follow through on your dreams. I know each and every one of you has some amazing gifts uh, inside of you and I hope this information helps bring those gifts out to the world. Thank you. My name is Sachin Patel and I wish you amazing health.